September 1, September the 24th, one day. Oh. Trying to get you on squad. Trying to get you on squad. Get you on squad. Now. Skype. Okay, buddy, I'll end this one, then we'll go Skype. See you in a minute, bud. We're going to Skype, um, Andy, um, uh, Divine, in Greece. Today, um, we're talking on any topic in Greece. Right, well, well I'll wait for him. Um, I'll call. Okay. Here we go. Right up. Um. Oh, he's not there yet. He's not there. Andy isn't online. Okay, I'll wait for him to get on. And uh, call in the divine bar. Divine bar. Divine bar, divine. Call me. Okay? Here. Oh, there we go. Hello? Camera. Hello, John. Hello, hello. Our, our camera. There's camera. Okay, you can hear me? Yeah, right. Okay. There you go, I'm all ready with my coffee. Um, and yeah. I've, I've just rolled in. I'll let you introduce. Oh, no, I just uh, my, my live feeds on now as well, so they, they can hear us. They can hear us on. Well, they will do. I mean, obviously, I'm not going to have any. Um, I won't have any people watching this because it's on my wife's. It's on my wife's live feed. Okay. Which base I'm, I'm strictly using just to uh, to record it so that it's very easy to download and put it onto YouTube. Okay. I'm running. I'm running one. Off so yeah. Okay. John, this is, this is John Manoa I'm talking to, and, and I've been removed off my uh, other accounts, and I tried to uh, bring him into a live feed on this one, but for some reason I uh, wasn't uh, able to bring him on. It wasn't allowing me, uh, when, I, when I typed his name into it, his was the only name out of all the rest of them that wouldn't come up, so uh, whatever, whatever, for why ever, for whatever, anyway. That was it, but basically John's here to uh, talk a bit... Uh, a bit more. I mean, I'm, I'm, if he's going to fill up a bit more on the details of uh, our first, um, our first call, which, by the way, is um, getting a lot of people. A lot of people haven't looked at it. I mean, it's, it's just slowly, slowly dropping. People are just, you know, when 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 other people now are talking about it, other people are jumping on to go and have a look at it, like. That. So people will be forming some good questions. John, just as a as a point, did did you know because. You put um, twenty the September. It was you. Was you thinking that it was going with Sean this Wednesday? Yeah. It's on twenty fourth of October. Sean says. Oh, I see. I see. That's okay. It's on. Yeah, it's on the twenty fourth of October because I, I I thought about it when when, it, when he said. Yeah. Because he said I, I'm blocked up till uh, October, so I knew it was. Uh, I think he said that the, at the time it was the twenty fourth of October. Oh. I mean, I know that you said the twenty fourth uh, of September. Which, by the way, was yesterday. So that's where the confusion was. Like, that's oh. okay. That's that's all that cleared up then. So, uh, right then, um, how is uh, how is uh, things? Have, have we any different? Uh, have we got anything any new from uh, last time we was talking? As well, regards, because uh, I think you said it was days now. Yeah. Well, I, I I'm always waiting for questions because I always have lots to talk about. I could cross over a whole sphere of things and land up on something, a different topic to what actually a topic you might have had in mind, and uh, we can always hinge around anything. But I can pluck off, I can uh, do an overview of where we're at at the moment, and then go from there. You can yeah. pick, pluck any question you want from there. So, uh, well, just t t I'll tell you what, just because of, um, because of the... Uh 
to, to try and uh, draw an interest where where people are a lot of people that the truth is out there that have understood. Did you uh, did you get the chance to watch that video that I sent you that uh, Elijah Priest uh, had done? Uh, no. What what was it about? What, what was it about? It was it was about uh, Elijah Priest was trying. He, he wants he wanted um, he was speak, speaking to a. A, an agent who who says he has diplomatic immunity, so on and so forth. He's a CIA and a hand, and he had handlers, and they wanted him to uh, give up. Uh, Elijah, Elijah was saying, you know, we want uh, Bush, we want him on the plate, like, and he so, and he wouldn't give him without giving him the information. He said it's not like that anymore. So he was saying we're the White Dragons. You know, and the white dragons have have the we're not fear, we're not fear of any of you. You know what I mean? Yeah. So it, it was it was more about oh. on that, that side of it because oh, okay. yeah. So I well, who, uh, who, who the families who the families are. I mean, what I mean, what what can be said? I don't know how how um, I don't know how open we can be speaking like that. Okay, I I mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. I want you to finish. Yeah, I say that because that's that's about. I mean, when it comes to, to comes to, to talking about them at the top, you have to be very careful of what you're saying. So, you know, I, I don't know that the, the twelve families that are that are controlling this uh, this planet right now. So, so basically, we want we we want remove. Obviously, we 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 need the removal. We need. Oh, sorry. I just had no comfort. I'm live stream at the moment, so I'll give you a call after. I mean, I'm yeah, I'm, I'm back. I'll just go back. Okay. 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 Bye. All right. Okay. Sorry. Sorry about that. That's my daughter. Make sure I got home. I just dro drove in from Auckland in the dark in the rain, and uh, I can see in the dark, so that's pretty good without glasses. Uh, <laughs> so my night well, vision's that, okay. That uh, so um, okay. I, I skipped over it before I went and I read a lot of it and not any of the m movies. I, I haven't, I, I didn't have time to look through that if there was movies. I only skipped over what, 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 uh, uh, what, what's written there. And uh, what I do here is I keep the kings separate from all of that. Um, all, all of what they're doing is none of my business. But I know what's going on. And um, I, I, I can talk about uh, the Bushes and all, all the families uh, in the royal, royal family, all, all hinged around the Queen and the Rothschilds and all, all, uh, if all directions, all, all different directions, with different businesses running separate to the Queen's business. The Queen looks after her own business, and so but they're dependent on her giving consent from Westminster. And so it's, um, it can drag out into the wars. The wars have started from this flag, put it that way. The jurisdiction of starting wars is the flag we have which is supposed to stop wars, not start them. It was supposed to, um, the king uh, said it's a protectorate for trade, and if anybody got in the road, the martial law applies. So these bushes and everybody used the martial law to get everybody out of the way and get rid of them and, and put a contract on someone to get rid of them. And that's what they do. They're, they're prolific with using and abusing that power. That we have the flag, the flag can stop using it when they find out who is in control of the flag. At the moment, no one's claiming to, to, to have control of the flag. It's hidden at the bottom of the ship of HM ships, in, in the, they'll only use it when they come into port to uh, ma manifest their, uh, uh, their um, uh, contraband and everything that's in HM underneath the ship to take off and in boxes that you can't see the gold shifting from one place to the other because it's got this protectorate flag on it hidden in the cabinet. The cabinet is the parliament, and the parliament's cabinet here is the authority to control 
uh, that business, the, the king's uh, commercial business, hasn't got someone that can say it's theirs, except us, the king's people, can say that. You see, so the Bushes and America and running that business, that's, that's the Queen and the Rothschilds business, it's their sinkhole, it's their playground, it's their do what they like uh, with, with this king's jurisdiction to uh, put martial laws on anybody. But when they apply the martial law, they'll, they'll create a, a, a scene and they'll put actors in and then away they go shooting everybody with the authority to shoot anybody in that cordoned off area. And they'll put, they'll put that as a, either a sovereign state or a state of emergency, which is this declaration of war flag we have. The 1834 declaration of war flag was going on the ships to declare war on anybody that got in the king's road between him and someone as a captain on a ship is a surrogate king. When he steps off onto the dry land, he says, the land belongs to the king. Right? And I have documents I proclaim this land belongs to the king. And so that's how they start the process of the magistrate court off the ship from Britain's magistrate court on the ship. And that man that's the captain or, or someone of a regiment in the navy will hop off the ship with that piece of paper from the king with his signature on it and declare a state of emergency if they, if they won't listen and start shooting. Right? So that's yeah. that's what the Bushes do. They 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 can use that contract to wipe anybody out, and that's what this flag we have can do to wipe anybody else out. That's breaking that law that belongs to our contract. We put the contract on someone that's using the flag for other interests other than a national interest of the public people, the king's common people. <coughs> It's a threat on their uh, uh, um, uh, investment interests from anyone who is um, uh, interfering with the government of the day, uh, of the business, of the people's business. So what the Bush has done is made another government out of this government and called it the federal state because this is the federal state. They, they use the federal state as another government of the private. That's how the private contracts come in with this flag. They can't make a private contract from Britain, Western Australia, any way else. So that's that's what I'm saying uh, about the Bushes, about uh, uh, all those families that are creating havoc to create business. It's, that's all it does. The, the, they're using the flag in reverse on pirates. Yeah. They, they make turn people into pirates and make them debtor, de de debts, uh, if they don't listen, they, they'll put a lien on it, the whole place, cordon it off, put a lien on it, and mortgage them to hell. And they can't get out of it, you see, so they've got their own documents. We have our own documents. We're going to start using the ones I've put together. They are original King William the Fourth ones from 1834 with the flag. So we start with his documents that was, we haven't used them yet on anyone, right, from that contract. So we are doing what the Bushes do, but with the masses. We have to get a membership of people with a mobile phone as being the minimum requirement to claim what we're going to get back from one piece of land or one stolen entity from... Uh, what is this? If the trade of that country, like England, Westminster, if the government finds somebody that's counter to the government's uh, ruling of the day, then they become a threat of the national interest of what somebody else is trading without the government knowing. Right? Yep. So here they are operating private businesses of their own and not telling anybody where the money's going against the interest of the people of Britain. So 
So all you have to do is this. The people of Britain should wake up and the people of Europe start asking questions. Where's the money going? And whose interest? Now that sets up a court case. We're, we're doing one two-hour court case in High Court of Admiralty in London. We have that option. The Queen said she's going to go to the World Court for her court hearing. You see? But she, do, she doesn't know that someone like myself being native has to protect our native interest title. And she has to look after her interests, but she's dragged the money out of HM Treasury and took it somewhere else against the money and the land and the resources of the natural people. That's where John Patterson and, and uh, Gordon Bowden comes in. They can attest to where that money's gone from HM Treasury. It's gone into the EU Parliament because she's putting in a safe over there and hiding it under King William III, the creator of the Bank of England and the creator of the Pound Note and the creator of the Eight Point Star over here and all of those authorities. She's going to, she's bluffed England out, got all the money out of it, gone over to, she's going to bluff the Dutchman out. Now, tell me, is a Scotty going to do in or rip off a Dutchman who's been sailing the seas for years and donkeys and the Portuguese and all those other Spaniards and all those people. The Spaniard, by the way, is Ernest Augustus, his family, uh, and, and the Philippines, Philippines uh, uh, president of the Philippines, which the Spanish uh, side of the Queen Victoria Trust, which is our trust. 1848, Queen Victoria set up a trust for the native people of New Zealand. And all that money that gone into the Philippines belongs to that trust. It's still our contract. That's the Queen contract with us after King William, right? She, she, right. she had to use his authority to trade with the trading flag, right? To skip from any country she can go to. You can go anywhere with the flag. And because they switched it in Victoria, Australia to Victoria University or v Victoria School here in New Zealand, and switch the title around to make it look like they had the authority of a king to take his contract and use it. They've tampered with our contract. And that's what I'm saying to the people of Britain. We're gonna call the counts and we're gonna call the counts up. We're gonna call the counts in, all of us, uh, collectively, to settle the count, Set settle, settle their trust. Right? All, all these sure. corporations are trusts. The trust is supposed to be trustworthy. It ain't a trust. It's, it's not trustworthy with papers written on. But that's how they make yeah. money. They, they make money from trusts and, and societies and um, uh, all those sort of things, charities and all that sort of thing. But um, it still boils down to for whose interest? For whose interest? And that's, that's why they have a private company and a limited company, uh, uh, but it's neatly hidden in the private side of contracts that the Queen, when you put a name and it's got apostrophes around it and not a limited on, it's a private company or PLC or, uh, or uh, uh, LLC or, or something like that, right? That's the part that Harold, yeah. Harold Link wanted to keep running with me. And I said, no, I'm the people's man. I'm the king's people's man. I've got I've got stakeholders. It's not only me, you see. I spread it all around because anyone in the world where the queen went to has a right to what I'm doing. I'm setting the plan up so that everybody, once they get this, once they get where the money's gone, we have a right to call the count up in Britain. The British military will be thankful that, thank goodness, King William put the flag over here to save Britain, because they've got a free run. The Queen and her family have a free run to do what they like with a free go anywhere flag, right? And these Maoris, her invented tribe, give her consent not knowing they didn't have no instructions with the flag. I just told my daughter today how the flag works. Well, she's shocked to hell that the eight-point star had lots of meaning. There's lots of meaning in that flag. No one's talking about it. 
It's got everything tied up in a five pound note in that flag. You see? Have you got the? Uh, have you got? Uh, have you got the um, description of the flag and it's um, what what it actually? I'll, what I'll it get it. Is. I'll get it. I'll get it. Oh, it's on the wall. It's on the wall up, up there. Um, I'll, I'll go and get it. We know. We know the, We know the flag. But have you got an actual? Is there a? Uh, is there a uh, link that people could just look at to see uh, to see the breakdown of the flag? Yeah, is so, there a link with the breakdown? Yeah, so it'll be on my uh, powerhouse dot uh, my powerhouse dot com. It, it's somewhere on there, yeah. but I'm going to put it on the new website. This flag on the new website to explain it. But I'll quickly quickly explain it what it is. Um, so so here you've got this little red cross here, and you've got the big red cross here, and so this is the King George's one, two, three, four, five, six. This one is just the contract but with King uh, William the Third, King William the Fourth, King George the Third, King George the Fourth, King Ernest Augustus the Fifth, in this little cross, and it's got a black strip around it to block off these other kings inside here, right? So, so that's oh, sucks. I've got the camera off. I, I'm, I'm trying. I, can you see me on your camera? I, yeah, I can see you. Yeah. So I'm just saying briefly that this flag has two crosses, the little one there in the corner and the big one here. That's, that's, that, that's for King George 1st, 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th, 6th, that big one. This one here is just for King William the 3rd, King William the 4th, King George the 3rd, King George the 4th, and King Ernest Augustus the 1st. This is this one with a black strip around the cross to keep the other kings out and any other king out of this contract. Right? Then you've got the eight-point star of St. Patrick in, in Belfast, where he's buried. The memorial of anybody buried is the, is, is the authority that King William III put this eight-point cross of his father, St. Patrick's father, was the uh, treasury of Westminster at the time. He was collecting the rents on the land and the uh, fines and all that for the king. And so he wanted his son to inherit all his wealth. But the son says, no, you go to hell. I want to go and look after the poor people in Ireland. And so he said, I don't want your money, it's dirty. And took off to uh, Ireland and set up his St. Patrick Church. It became popular, that popular, that his father wanted to, to bring him back into England. And they banished him from England from ever practicing as a bishop. He never, he never got his wish, but they used his good work for the common people in Westminster to keep this going as an authority in Belfast, right? As his memorial to his father in Westminster to keep this commerce going. So that's north, east, south, west of the four, uh, four uh, crosses, uh, eight point stars, that King, Queen, Queen, Queen Elizabeth, Prince Philip, and all the royal families are wearing this. They're the wrong bloodlines. They didn't do this. It was these kings in this little cross that did that, not the other King George the First, King George the Second, and King George the Sixth. Those ones never put this contract together. They've usurped it for their own royal families and the Rothschilds, usurping this contract and our contract with us. Now we can go in at, with Britain and everybody in Europe that's been affected by the Queen and her uh, third party. Uh, financial investment interest for their own interest and whipped it out of out, out of out of Westminster to put it in to start the EU Parliament off and uh, uh, against the national interests of people uh, that it's supposed to be for. When you have a government and someone uh, um, is going around the back of the government to bring in arms or, or to uh, set up something against the government as treason then that's against the people interest that they're taking something out of the land and selling it uh, uh, to someone else against the government. They're doing exactly that to the people. They're taking things away from the people and that's our gripe. Our gripe is a legal one and we're going to use this flag to counter them for our national interest of investment that's gone skippy 
somewhere else. And, and, and that's what this, this is a commercial trading bank flag of a king, the only king's flag in the world, that can seize land. It, it, it's a declaration of war flag to cordon off an area, like the city of London, cordon it all off, then make it a sovereign state and seize everything and then reissue the titles. That's what they did to New Zealand. When the Australians came here to New, to New Zealand, they put their titles, their, their married land court titles, on New Zealand. And then the French came and put theirs on the South Island of New Zealand. And then the British came along and seized the whole lot and reissued the titles in the Manukau name, right? The, the original Manukau name. And that's what we're going to do. We're going to seize with the British military See, see, the military, we can, we can order the military collectively from Europe because Europe more or less has stolen the wealth out of Britain, out of the Westminster Treasury to get them going. I was there right through when the Queen signed with Gordon Brown to, to the, got rid of the seven treaties or eight treaties, then left, with, left them with the Lisbon Treaty in Brussels to run this new government parliament for the Queen and her private business under King William III, right? That's this flag, King William III's flag. All those contracts are here, okay? So that, that's shortened up version of the only flag that can talk like that. I'm talking for their flag and the King's because no one else can and have the documents in, in the room here to go with it and the chiefs that right. time. So it's not the Treaty of Waitangi, that's the Queen's title. She used, she, what she did with this 1834 flag, she made it into an 1835 flag and then opened up her new 1840 treaty and usurped this lot. So that's why they put it on flag run whenever they want and take it off to run the other one up the top, the Union Jack 200 miles out. The Union Jack flag is still on the sea of Admiralty out there. And so that's why they have the courts with the bar, the sandbar, to jump over into the courthouse. So we say, what's your courthouse doing on our land? Take your bar and go back in the city. We're going to shut your bar down and we're going to put this back in. Right? We don't need a bar with this. It's on dry land. The only flag in the world that's been given on dry land from Westminster. Everything of the King's Conquered lands is Westminster. It's nowhere else. The uh, uh, Brussels and uh, the World Court belongs to King William, the Dutchman. What's the Scot woman doing in Dutchland claiming to be an ancestor of the Dutchman? Mm, tell me that. And there she is, under all that gold, thinking she's going to get it in the Caribbean. Mm? That's just one lady. One lady has done so much damage. But she's good at it. Ignorance wins. At the end of the day, ignorance wins. People keep bowing to her because physically she looks like, well, I'm going to fool them today. I'm going to put on my best dress, put best smile, put my eight-point star on as if it's mine. And the illusion keeps going. Okay? So she said, as long as I get paid for my royal duties, I'll put my son there. He can look after it while I go and play games in EU Parliament and throw stones from there at the British because I don't like them anymore. I, I don't like, I don't want them anymore. I, I, I'm sinking the ship over there because I've got a new one over here. It's made of gold. See? And so that's all it's been. The, uh, the, the, those Bush families, all the royal families of the, of the Queens, the Bushes and, and all the and Obama, all, all their... The, they are linked in some way, and Trump, Trump is a Scotty. So you've got two Scotties at the moment signing behind the back door with the other Scotty, Gordon Brown. Well, now it's Trump, the other real estate guy. You know, he's stupid. He likes tweeting. And he lets the cat out of the bag and says to everybody, Oh, I'm this today. I'm going to get rid of those. Those are bad laws. Those are bad laws. And it says, he's put there because he's been told what to do by these bushes. Otherwise, it clink, uh, and 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 so he's better off uh, with his money that he's getting paid for doing that, 
and he's real estate, he can't run it. So someone else is running it for him, so he's collecting that as well. And he's getting his pension, so that comes out of this flag as well. The pension, everything comes out of this, because we give the people a bit of pension, 26,000, and we keep the rest out of 100 million, but we'll boost our pensions up, you see? They get their pensions after they retire because they're on call. I'm talking about politicians. They're on call. They're still getting paid sitting at home or on a cruise ship out in the sea, breaking everybody's money off them, playing the games. See? So that, that, this is folded up in the cabinet of the captain's hold in the, underneath as the authority. They won't show it, but when they go into port, they sign on this. It has to have a flag in, in the ship, but the Queen is using it and uh, uh, lending it. She's, she's lending it out to these other countries to use because it's a Royal George flag and the Vatican, read the Red Vatican, the Vatican, the ecclesiastic part of the Vatican where they get their authority from to, to uh, use British laws in Rome is because they claim St. Patrick as a Catholic. Well, he's a Protestant, but they say, no, he's a Catholic. So in America, Catholics say, oh, we'll, we'll be the green man, and we'll, 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 we'll dance around the St. Patrick's Day. But when you look at him and say, oh, he's Irish. No, 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 he's not. He's Welsh. Oh, no, no, no. He's, he's Catholic. He, he, was, he was born a Catholic, but he died in Irish, like uh, that's where that's where he's buried. So where you're buried, where your memorial is, that's where the title is. Just remember, all the churches with all their memorials, they are titles. Winston Churchill, that's a title, you know. And Washington D.C., he's a title. We big guy like that. And uh, the Freemasons, they've got their memorial stones all over the place, and that's their title. What they call uh, uh, survey mark, right? The, 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 the thing like that, you know, cross and, and a compass. That, that, yeah, yeah. That, that, that's the, that, they go out with their spyglass and put the thing over the land, put the pegs up, and they put the memorials in the big um, thing, uh, obelisk, obelisk. So those are titles. So you've got titles all over the place in stone. But the Queen Victoria took the Moai statue of Easter Island and took it to England in 1868. That's when they took the sovereignty of America, right? When that topaz ship picked it up, took it to England, hid it for over 100 years, but they used that memorial stone and locked it up in the museum and all the other memorials from all the other countries they conquered and put them in the museum and then took all their power out of those countries. Those are titles. So all those countries, we take our Moai statue out of there, everybody's going to want their titles back. With this, the shipping, license. This is a license to print money. Right? That's why I got the power note. Nobody's saying anything about me with the power note. Because I'm allowed to do that if I know what I'm doing with it. Who's, um Who's, um, whose head's going to be going on the uh, new pound notes? Is it going to have the head on the, the new pound notes? Or, or the new, the new, is, it, is the money that's going to be created? Because obviously the, 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 the old money with the Queen's head on is going to be uh, null and void. No, the, so what would the, be the their money phases out. It'll phase itself out. When this one yeah. supersedes it, then people will be buying that one and using this one as that one's a debt one, just a credit one. Right? Oh, yeah. So what happens is we only make one pound note, just one pound note, uh, the rest is digital. Everything that I do is tag pay is digital. In France they've oh, got yeah. tag pay, which is foolproof on the mobile phone number. You, you can't scan it. it. I can give you a hundred thousand straight out and it gets straight to you with under a minute. Under a minute in a text, and that's all it costs, 20 cents, to send you 100,000 100, minimum. And that's how safe it is. It's been like that. They've got about 23 countries now but in France, so I was using it 
in 2012. I had it on my site. It was all going. But when the guys ripped me off, Julian N. Falcon, a lawyer, and um, Martin Secluna, the banker, in Lloyd's Bank, ripped my money out, it stopped me getting my tracks. And so it's taken me all this time to start up from scratch with nothing to where I am now, making negotiations with Harold. Uh, and uh, I put those tidal turbine stuff with Blue Energy Canada, Canada on, on Facebook. There's 172 pages of this and that, but the letters from the government here supporting and, and uh, power companies. So those are all commercial interests that I set up with the government here and the government of Canada with Mark Berger. So if anyone is going to muck around with the water, sea, water, while we're in there, they're going to come up against this. So long as Britain is still Britain, the Queen can't be a king, Queen of Britain because there's already a king there with a long line of kings to Britain. Britain is, 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 is on the compass as being a trading nation state, right? And you've got the EU, Britain, America, so, but not the Queen of England. That, that's gone as, uh, as uh, uh, the Queen, the Church of England, the Queen of England, and everything on those documents um, uh, are changed now because she's changed uh, herself into the EU Parliament and, and they can't have another King of England they can't have, can't have a king of Scotland because these kings were kings of Scotland, Ireland, Northern Ireland, Wales and England. So you can't go and do it again because it's already here, locked in history and locked in legacy and legitimacy in here, in this flag. They can't change this contract. It's too strong for anybody. And all I'm doing is accounting for the native side of the contract. And Matt Taylor accounts for the British side of the contract. And all the surnames that come from Britain here weren't told how the instructions, where's the instructions for this? None. Because they gave it to the chiefs. It's nobody's business to know. I'm telling you what the chiefs told me. You see? I'm telling you because no one would, no one would, would tell a story like that. This is the first time it's ever been told like that. Apart from, uh, apart from the sea and the sky and the blue. And I've told you, um, this here is the municipalities, the eight points start to collect the money and the lease. And now the seabed leases get collected with this eight points car in Westminster. See? So everything that's in the world court cannot match up against the magistrate court. If you ask yourself which is the higher authority, the will court or the magistrate, you see, the will court can't do trillion pound claims. Only the magistrate. Right? It's a bank. It's a bank. The, 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 the will court is not a bank. The will court is not a bank. This is a bank. Just going on. Just going more on to the money side of things, yeah. because obviously the fear of the digital currency is a is a big fear because of the one world orders and the, and the uh, one world currency, and um, obviously the chip and pin of everybody. So, what would um, how would um, normal Joe Joe Blogs okay. doing a foreign, doing his work with how would they exchange uh, money? What would the money that what, what, oh, what would okay. that money exchange? Okay, what we have here is the K King William's got the gold coins. And um, no. um, we're, we're, we're using the gold coin until we get the gold coins, but that's a military side, okay? So we use digital um, uh, currency against that gold coin that's original. Wherever the gold is hidden, we're putting it up against it hidden, okay? okay. We're saying to the British, sure, yeah. we've got an X amount of worth value. That's what I said to Harold Link. I've got this pound note that's worth 970 million trillion trillion. It's a figure. I said, anywhere between. And so we use anywhere between for a value on something. Now the value of everything missing, we, we can assess like a tax department does, what's missing from the revenues. 
you just need to look at each year of the GDP to find how much on a scale has been made every year and then you can work out what's missing. You see? And so we, we value what's supposed to be there and where it, it's gone on arms because they say, oh, we need protection. You see? They say, we're protecting you, but no, they're protecting their own interests with money to shoot everybody to make more money. They're, they're, they're not using it for its intended purpose to keep everybody out of the trade. They're, they're shooting you both take the land, right? Like a good pirate, climb on the land with, with the magistrate and the admiralty and start to shoot everybody off the land and put them somewhere else because this can seize everybody as property. That's what this does. So for currency, like you're saying for currency, we use like how they would if there's money in the bank. I've got those notes sitting in the ANZ bank. I start using it against the property. What? Get one land, I'll take the whole of New Zealand as being a, a trillion trillion, right? I start yeah. debting the land with that power note as instrument. So and will, will, it, will, it, will it be going back to then the, the original, which is, well, I say the original as in, will it be going back to having uh, bonds, pieces of paper that, with, that is backed by gold? Will, um, it be going, will it be going back the same way as that? No, no, I'm doing it this way. We're doing it with shares, like a normal trust. The share value of your 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 share um, is what we recover. That's the, the, what 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 we are using as income would be the fraud, the the tidal turbine, the the order produce on the land that the government's taken for itself. We we, we start billing them uh, for the use of the, the, those resources for their interests. We set up our own interests, right? We set up our interests with the military in Britain because they're getting shafted too, see? So we'll reinstate the military first with a pound note as, as a, uh, uh, a lien over something that's missing, right? We, ca we can, we ca we're not going to print gold coins. We can have only credit as being puts it in the machine and it spits it out of their money. We use their money in their bank because it's like this. I say to the NZ Bank, look, you buy the you buy the trillion pound from us at four percent. Just slightly lower than the other banks. That they've got to buy it three times. They've got to buy it from uh, the US Federal State. Right? They, the federal state buys it from, uh, uh, um, from the, the Rothschilds, the bank, right? And they and and they and they pay the royalties to the queen, three three times, that money turns over before you get it. Okay. And that and they flood the world out with the U.S. dollar. Well, we don't have to go, do that. We just go straight out with this because this created that jurisdiction. So we, when we do the pound note, we, 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 we use the instrument in any bank as being um, to the land of the people, to the king's conquered land, right? I'm, I'm using New Zealand because that's the model. I use New Zealand as if I get Cook Street, that's uh, 2.715 billion, right? That's just that's just the building that's supposed to go up. You see, they didn't put it up because they stole the money and switched the land title. And I told them, don't, don't you develop it because you're going to lose it all. That's why it's not developed. They just tidied it up and left it like that. I just called into Helensville today on my way back and I took a photo of where this native magistrate court started in this country for the whole world. And I just updated it. They are keeping it in its original state, just the lawn, and and the old flag board is still there. With the flag, we, we had all our meetings there, 
not those Jews that died there, but the legacy is still there. They won't take it away because they'll wipe themselves out. The gene trees, all the mechanics, the lawyers, the shopkeepers, the accountants, those were all the ones that came with the money and the captain on the ship, right? That gave them the authority from the king to develop the land and their business. So I've got all that in here, up in Helensville. You see? And that, that was the blueprint for the whole world there in 1823, right? Before this flag came out, before this flag, they were trading here in 1820 from Australia and France, and Australia, France, France went down South Island and they took over the whole South Island. When the British came and blew up uh, the chiefs up north in Russell, blew them up and took the native British native caught out of there and took it down to Helensville. And then they put the Manukau title on. That's the one I've... Uh, the, they, they opened up the new one with the Manukau title. See? Uh, uh, and so this, that's this one. I'm keeping that going because the Chiefs told me to keep it going. But until I, I'll finish it off. And reinstate its, uh, uh, its contract here and over there in Britain. So now it's spread, it, now the tentacles of the Bushes and everybody else, and the Clintons and everybody, it's the tentacles have gone right up through the world, because it's a world flag, and so we follow where all the tentacles have gone, and build a whole ark, you see, back to Westminster, and yep. reinstate Westminster, and clean the Muslims off, because they've been put there to mess the whole place up with the Bush family, uh, and, and, and the Queen's... That's, that's the Queen's royal family, the Bushes and all the rest of them, from America. America belongs to the Queen in a commercial world, right? It's just, it's just her business. We can seize her business because she ran away with the spoon, okay? Went to your country over there, in Europe, and set herself up under King William III, and we go and trap her with this. In the world court, we walk in here, in the world court was this, and the court will say, so what took you so long? <laughs> <laughs> so what they'll say to me, so how much gold do you want? I said, I know where all the dust is, it's in the Caribbean. They, they, they put it in dust so you can't see the gold bars, so it's all yellow dust when you put your thing on it. Like it's all yellow dust. And so they just pick some dust out and melt it all up and we've got some gold bars. So we're going to use Caribbean for our currency. But that's that sound good? So that's what we do and use King William III's authority in Brussels. Yeah. It's good for them because they're going to get well, a cut. The, the, main, the main thing here is, like I was saying, you know, like, um, to keep it basic, to keep it to, as, the, as the normal Joe Bloggs, like, I'm doing a foreigner. I'm, I'm going out and doing some work. I'm doing some work on someone's house. How is uh, I go down there and I do some work? What is he going to put into my hand? If um, but, I mean, I what? Yeah. How do, does it, Because this is the thing. The digital scare people. If if, if it's all by scan, by scan, no one, no, the people are going to be whoa. I don't want anything to do with that. People love to feel something and, and to be able to hand something over. So what what would that okay. what would that be then? Would that be right. would that be like notes with gold in the in the notes or no no this is how it is. This is how it is. What I do is yeah. this. I make a deal with the ANZ Bank. They buy the note instead of going to the Treasury, because this is a this is more federal. And so they'll we use the ANZ Bank in Britain. Because uh, uh, there's the, the bank, in, uh, ANZ Bank is Australia Bank, it's in Britain. It'd be in Australia, so it's already gone through all the other countries. So we use the notes in that country and convert them with this currency here. Right? So we use one bank, it's good for the bank because they're getting a better deal from us. You see? Yeah. They'll buy our note on the security of the land underneath the bank. Right? Multiplied by all the ANZ banks. That's what I put them up to. I put them up to that because I'm a broker and I brokered the deal. 
and put those notes and deposited them. And they said, we need to Cook Street with its title, bring it in. So as soon as I take it in, it's an instrument of value. Right? Sure. I take it into the bank, they turn it into cash. But this is real land that belongs to someone, not thin air money like the Rothschilds. Right? This is the real deal money, one you can see. The land is the money. Sure. Okay? The land is the money. And everything in it, the gold's in the land. You know what President Duterte did in Philippines? They wouldn't let him touch the gold. So he put a state of emergency from Britain and took the land. With the gold in it, intact. Smart boy. But whose gold is it? I wrote them and I says, excuse me, whose trust is that? You see? Whose trust? Yeah. Whose, whose gold? It might be from your land, but whose name on it? Why can't you get any of it? Because it belongs to Britain. See? It's your country, yes, but you're not the driver. We're the driver. Mm -hmm. We're the driver. See? So all we're doing is changing the driver. Yeah. And getting a new set of wheels for it. Yeah. So all we have to do is do one, Cook Street one, pull one card out and the whole lot falls over. Put one card Sorry. out on one land. When, 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 when well, is that actually happening? When it, you see, I don't have to pay the fees. I could have gone, but I don't want to get arrested twice. But I don't think they'll arrest me this time uh, uh, for taking Cook Street again. You see, because you're supposed to have a license debt collector to go and take it, right? right? The police wouldn't do it because they said, we need a court order. I told them, come with me, I'm going to take the land, you see, because there's a fraud in there. Now they're mixed up in the fraud. The police are tampering with that title. See, they, they're not title people. They're, they're not title people. Lawyers are not title people. They only administer documents. You know, it's like sending a mechanic in to build a house or, 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 or someone who's not a mechanic fixing a diesel engine. Pull the piston out and put it upside down. You see? Mm. So, so you wouldn't want anybody playing around with a jet engine that's not an engineer. Right? And so, yep. and, and, and so um, th the money to put people's mind at ease, I have to, be, I have to do the first one to make sure it works. Uh, uh, like they say, the captain will jump off the ship last. I, I'll say the, the ship is not going to sink as far as I'm concerned because I've blocked all the holes up for anybody trying to get away. See? No one's going to escape, no one's going to escape a weather-tight ship that's completely foolproof with anybody trying to put something across in their legal documents. Right? Mm -hmm. In my word against you. Another yours. point. Another main uh, main point is because um, a lot of people now are talking about King's Bench. Yeah. What is the uh, what is the time scale? Do you think it will be before we see King's Bench back? The King's Bench is already there. You have to go and sit in. Well, I don't care. When do we, and when it ungagged and when do we see it? When will we? When it? When will it be ungagged and when will we see? And will we actually see a court of law where we can actually see it, where a fact can be heard and tried in? Well, I have as to, it is now, I, I, or the court. I, I, I've been running native King's Bench courts on the Marais, which is the highest native court in the world. It's the Marais. I've done eight of them so far to lock the native title in that court. They're using Waitangi Marai as a native court for their jurisdiction to use that, right? So I'm stepped in there, I, I, I've told, I've warned them that the day will come when they can't do that anymore. Stop them and stop the lot. Stop them from using theirs. So all I'm doing is trying to educate these Maoris. It's hard for them to change from Maori into this. You see? Uh, they're duped out, they're, they're conditioned to stay.